Have you ever watched Winnie the Pooh? Well, that might be the least depiction of what a bear might look and behave like. Today, we will correct those misconceptions and show you 30 interactions of what a real bear looks like. Already having his bear spray aimed at the bear, this guy cautiously takes steps backward. The bear, clearly unaware of what the spray is, remains alert yet continues to advance towards the man. Hey, bear. It's okay. He manages to put a significant distance between himself and the bear as the animal pauses behind a fallen tree, giving the man a moment of relief. However, this relief is fleeting as the bear resumes its approach. Hey, bear. Hello, bear. Hey. The bear begins to display its agility, climbing up and descending the trees in its path leaving the man baffled by this behavior. Hey, bear. Hey. From a distance, he sprays the bear directly in the eyes, effectively driving it away. Thankfully, the bear doesn't look back as it retreats. This person, who was trucking through the North Pole, ended up finding one of the only animals that actively hunts humans right underneath his truck. The polar bear sits under the steps of the truck and tries to reach the guy through them as he films it. Thankfully for him, the biggest living land carnivore is in a good mood, flocks back down and goes about its day, probably because it already had something to eat, or else the story might have been different. These folks are out on vacation in Alaska and stopped by the trail to wait and let a car-sized grizzly bear walk by. Look at that thing, and imagine seeing it in person. It might have taken a whole day to take in what had just happened. Hey, bear. Hey, bear. The bear walks in front of them and goes right to the board, only to turn around and start heading back. At that moment, it does not go by without glancing at the tourists, and they should be glad that the animal did not show any further interest in them. Hey, bear. Hey, bear. These rock climbers were having a difficult time climbing this steep portion of the rock they found. The guy slips and takes a break on the little rock beside it when all of a sudden, they attract an audience they never thought they would. He instantly walks down so that the bear doesn't suddenly jump up to him, and the animal climbs onto the other rock to take a better look as well. The two have a stare-off to see who will leave first and as soon as he unties himself, the guy loses as he walks off. Here is an encounter that can probably teach you a lot of things about what you should do when a grizzly charges at you full speed. Let's take a look at how these photographers almost met a gruesome end. They were busy looking at this bear as it peacefully looked for its next meal in the water when suddenly it began charging at them as it must have felt like it had found its meal and it's them. One of the photographers takes a daring step and charges towards the animal shouting at it. This action turns out to be quite effective causing the grizzly which had bared its teeth to retreat with its tail tucked between its legs. 
His friends should definitely reward him with something nice for this brave act. This hunter shows us his professionalism and bravery when he and his dog are suddenly approached by a bear that is as angry as you can find them. It charges towards the hunter, but he holds steady and does not shoot at it. The animal comes back and it is as if it knows that if it gets any closer, it will be lights out for the bear, and it dives back into the forest once again. You can hear the hunter's breathing getting deeper and deeper with every charge. <laughs> the bear seems to be confused. It does not want to approach the guy and get any closer, but it also seems threatened at the same time. The dog seems to be missing in action throughout this, as it might not want to come in between them. A bear made its way into a neighborhood where it saw a small kid and walked right over to him, smelling and checking the poor guy out. That is when a hero comes in with his arms wide open, trying to get the bear's attention off the kid. The bear runs off as the guy successfully manages to intimidate it and probably ended up saving the little kid's life. If you live next to a forest, it might be a good idea not to send small kids alone out in the streets, knowing full well that there are bears in the area. A group of hikers came across a local in the forest that had them stop at a distance to admire his beauty as everyone took out their phones to capture the moment. Everybody makes sure to keep their distance and not make his attention divert towards them. You think they know? Probably not. I was shouting pretty loud there for like a minute. The bear actually knows that there are people here, as these guys can smell you from miles away. But seeing how many people there are, it chooses to ignore them and keep them at a distance. More people roll up to the spot, but the bear does not move from its spot. A tree or anything, he was just walking towards our room. Oh, I see him. These photographers encounter a large young grizzly bear as the animal makes its way over to them, driven by curiosity to check out what they are and why they are here. They remain seated as the bear stays calm, for now. There is another bear all the way back, but this guy is brave enough to walk right past these guys as they film the animal in all its glory. They should feel blessed at this moment. We all know how grizzlies sometimes act when people try to get close to them. A person, busy unloading his pickup truck, gets a visit from a friendly black bear, seemingly eager to lend a hand with the task. Understandably, the guy is a bit skeptical and cautiously backs away from the bear. The bear nearly climbs aboard the truck, peeking inside, likely in search of food, Unfortunately for our furry friend, it finds only hardware supplies. In the end, it walks away. What else is there for a bear to do after such a discovery? Imagine sitting by a small lake and looking over your shoulder to see a couple of bears coming your way. That is exactly what happened to this girl. Oh, bear. Hey!
The cubs take a moment to look into what the woman brought in her bag, while the mother bear starts acting a bit erratic. The woman is forced to put some distance between them. She is eventually forced to the other side, but the bears keep coming her way, and that makes her freak out. It looks like they are interested in not just the bag, but also the owner. Hey! Hey, stay back! She jumps into the water as the mother bear takes action to drive her away. Thankfully, the bear did not decide to swim. These guys are pretty good swimmers. A couple of cyclists take a break from all the cycling, resting alongside a tree to regroup at this spot. Little do they know, they're about to be visited by a local resident. Here we're about to witness the peaceful side of grizzly bears, showing how they probably won't attack people in large groups. The grizzly ambles up to where they are, casually strolling past without any fuss. These guys should feel honored to be in the presence of such a calm bear, especially in a setting as beautiful as this. The only thing separating this person from a black bear entirely invested in her is a tree that's not even wide enough to hide behind. She tries her best to stay as silent as possible while the bear completes its investigative foray. Hello. Hello. The bear gets hold of her jacket, ripping it from her hands and tossing it to the ground. That really puts her on edge, and she should be grateful it wasn't her arm in those jaws. After that, the bear stands calmly and walks away, probably believing it has inflicted some damage. No. Here in Yellowstone, folks pause to gaze at a grizzly bear strolling right past their car, her cubs trailing not far behind. She ambles peacefully, exploring the surroundings. Crossing to the other side, she keeps her nose raised, sniffing the air for any hint of food. After a moment, the cubs emerge from the bushes, trailing behind their mother, who awaits them on the other side of the road. They hurriedly navigated around, likely a bit intimidated by the white truck. This guy might be black in color, but he is a grizzly bear that has sniffed these guys out and is now headed their way. People stay still, trying not to make any sudden movements or noise, unsure of what might happen if they do. The bear simply ignores them as they hide behind the bushes for cover. It's likely preoccupied with other thoughts, like what to eat next or how to store up for the upcoming winter hibernation. Regardless, that right there was a stroke of luck and these guys probably got the footage they were hoping for. A cat has the pleasure of meeting a black bear that walks right up to the front door of this house. However, it isn't happy to see this bear up close and personal, so it lets out a little pounce that scares the big bad bear away. This hunter, perched atop a tree, was discovered by a black bear and her cubs who came right under the tree he was sitting on. The mother takes a good look at him and pauses directly beneath him.
After sniffing around his tree, the family begins to walk away slowly, yet the mother remains wary of the human perched above. It must be a really awkward moment for her, but at least her family is safe. It looks like a black bear has wandered into the beautiful backyard of this house, adding an unexpected liveliness to the scene. Oblivious to what's unfolding behind them, the kid on the swing continues to soar blissfully as the bear edges closer. Unfazed, the kid swings on. Even as the bear exits the camera's frame, likely standing right behind her now. The moment her swing session ends, she looks back, lets out a scream, and dashes inside with lightning speed. It seems it's high time to reinforce those fences. A second encounter might not end so harmlessly. Talk about a close encounter, am I right? And speaking of which, here's the closest one anyone could probably have. A mother hides her child's face as he cries out while the bear takes its time ravaging through their food. The animal acts as if it doesn't even know there are people there goes to show just how much these animals think about food. They'd rather risk themselves to get as much food as they can inside their bellies. The mother and child do their best not to move. And if that isn't excellent parenting, then I don't know what is. The poor kid is not only scared, but will also be upset about the fact that he won't have anything to eat at this picnic. These bikers stumbled upon a challenging situation when one of their friends fell off his bike and a bear pounced right on top of him. Luckily, he had the speed to get away just in time, and the bear got busy with the bike instead. This guy finds himself stuck between two options when a bear decides to climb onto the ladder he's used to reach this tree. Option one, let the bear climb up and then jump down, or option two, Stay put and see what unfolds. Bears do not climb ladders. While waiting for the man to make his move, the bear bites down on one of the ladder's rungs, possibly hinting at its intentions towards the guy. Eventually, even the bear grows tired of the standoff and just lays down on the steps, likely wishing the guy would accidentally tumble into its paws while daydreaming about how it might reach him. I am never going to get to shoot a bear. This is ridiculous. Legend has it, they're both still in that very same spot to this day. This incredible duo confronts a massive bear in their backyard. The guy gently pats his dog, signaling it to take action, but the dog seems just as hesitant. Suddenly, the bear makes a powerful leap towards them, prompting both to sprint away in an instant. Oh my god. Josh. Oh my god. These people came across a mother bear and her cubs by the water, instantly prompting the female bear to charge at them. The moment is too close for comfort, so the guide fires a warning shot to let the bear know not to mess with them. Okay. 
This helps in keeping her at bay for the rest of the trip, but it's a close call for both parties. In the confusion, these guys also lost a paddle, now facing yet another problem to tackle. You must miss. I knew it was going to happen when they didn't. When the People stopped to take a look at a bear that was just on the side of the road, but what they saw was just short of being called crazy. A guy wanted to feed the animal with his hands by walking right up to it, and of course the bear showed him why he should not have. <laughs> he tries to scare the bear away, but the animal, being young and therefore more curious, keeps coming back to the guy to see what he's trying to do. Now they have a standoff, and they don't know what to do now. This traffic jam is not because of an accident or anything, but it's because people are stopping to see this mother bear and her cubs walk along the side wall of the road. Of course, if anyone saw this, they would stop their car and look at them. This person opened up a garbage can and was met with a surprise as a black bear suddenly jumped out of it. The bear seemed to be just as surprised as the guy himself as both of them ran as fast as they could in a cartoonish manner. Imagine enjoying a view that seems to take pleasure in your company as much as you do in its beauty. Here, a person is joined by a massive yet serene grizzly bear. The bear calmly sits beside him, equally captivated by the view. Who could ask for a more extraordinary companion? I doubt anyone could. strolls behind him, having had its fill of the scenic beauty. The man is initially startled, but the bear, careful not to cause any disturbance, gracefully retreats back into the lush grassland from whence it came. After spotting a bear approaching, this guy decides to fend it off himself. He grabs a stick and begins yelling at the creature. At this point, the animal seems largely unfazed by his efforts. The bear, notably a smaller one, suddenly charges toward his legs. As the guy swings his stick and strikes the bear multiple times, it only seems to aggravate the animal further. Following this near-violent encounter, the little bear retreats, though not before inflicting significant pain on the unfortunate guy. It appears the bear was either lost, or its mother was, thankfully, too distant to intervene on the youngster's behalf. This person films from their main door as a brown bear makes its way into his neighborhood and is now coming his way as the guy has grabbed the animal's attention. He quickly shuts his door and gets inside just in time, because when those ears roll backwards, that is a clear sign that a bear just might attack you. <laughs> 